stir and to get the eggs ready. I'll put two eggs. And I always crack my eggs to make sure that they are good. Okay. That was one of the things my mother taught me. Now, I am going to begin to pour in the broth. You want me to stir something? You pour. Now, where y'all don't, you don't have those strong arms. Okay. One of the other things that I do when I'm cooking, while I'm doing it, I'm also praying over the food, that the food will be so delicious, that Jesus will make it so good. What do you think of that? Is that a good idea? Yes. Because if Jesus is in it, he make everything good. As it going in, I can take a little bit more consistency of the liquid. Juliana, the chicken is ready. Turn it off and take it out of the pot and put it in the plate. Emiliana, we have got the chicken. It's done. Take the skin off. Okay. But we can cut it up and put it into the dressing. Or we can mix it. Here is a fork. Okay. And I'll take it out. Take it off the mix. I'm Juliana since now as she's putting that in I'm going to take and put some of the hot broth from the breast boiling in. This is to make it more moist.
Okay, what I did, I put uh, 18 ounces of chicken broth from Swanson and two cups of broth from the boiling of the bread to make it moist and ready for to go in the oven. So how do you know when it's moist? Oh, when it's easy to for you to stir through. And that would be six It'll be 12 ounces of broth, hot broth, and 14 ounces of uh, chicken broth from the can. That makes good consistency right there. Okay, and final, some black pepper. So, I see, yeah, that's about it. in the bottom but to keep it from sticking lightly. That's it. Not really on a spoon. The dressing into the pan. Getting it ready for the oven. to put it in the oven for 30 minutes on 350 and let the heat go through it fully and then we have our dressing to be ready. This is our dressing finished. Happy Thanksgiving to everyone.